Hey everybody, I'm Drew. And I'm Vince. And welcome back to some Zero Time Dilemma. Let's go ahead and pick up where we left off. You did Completed. it. Completed. <laughs> cool. <clears throat> uh, That's it for them for now. So I've got to do... Okay, so it looks like I've got to hop back and forth. Yeah. All right. Um, there's no, there's nothing extra for doing this uh, in Diana's path, right? This looks all completed. Yeah, no, it's all done. Okay. All right. Oh, let's go. Let's go with D team then. You did things in the same order I did. <laughs> well, yeah, because <laughs> I also like Sigma and Phi. <laughs> yeah. When a curious hate oozes calamity. Hmm. So, a moment when hate becomes calamity, huh? Hmm. I wonder what that means. Beats me. Maybe it's not supposed to have a meaning. Huh? It's an anagram. <laughs> you reorganize the letters into another sentence. Why do you think it's an anagram? I've seen something like this before, in another place. Anyway, where's Sigma? For a second I thought he was like passed out drunk on the table. <laughs> what are you looking at? A box. What kind of box? A red I'm box. I'm looking into it because I don't know. Force quit box. So they have one too. Hmm. That's I'm kind of got the feeling everybody would have one. <laughs> Use this keyboard to input a password and force something to stop. Is that what this means? What does it stop? Well, the obvious answer would be the game Zero is making us play. Then we should try it. I shouldn't have thought it would be that easy. We need a hint. Maybe it says something on the underside. Nope. Won't budge. It's heavy. Is it heavy? <laughs> heavy doesn't even begin to cover it. I doubt it's made out of anything from Earth. <laughs> well, you are getting up there, Sigma. What do you say? My body's still got it. <laughs> <laughs> She's just like, um... <laughs> you weren't lying. See, I told you. Again, a map? <laughs> Looks like it. Healing room. <laughs> yeah. How very descriptive of you. <laughs> we want, so long as it's within this ward? Yes, that's what Zero said. So we got a prep room, we got a decontamination room. Seems largely the same. Yep, that's the healing room. Huh, nice little piano. <laughs> Transporter room. <laughs> Robot room. <laughs> Robot <laughs> house! <laughs> Robot house! <laughs> Alright, we've checked all the rooms from top to bottom, but... You didn't find any exits? Obviously. We are in a bomb shelter, after all. If there were several exits, it'd defeat the purpose it was built for. So Zero told the truth. And opening the X door is the only way out. <laughs> that nod. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Mira! <laughs> These Mira! guys are taking a lot on faith. Can you hear me? Yeah. Carlos! Akane! Tenmyoji! I like the touch that That's Sigma right. calls him Tenmyoji. <laughs> we wouldn't hear a drunk right? party at full volume on the other side. <laughs> 
think we need six passwords to get this door to open, right? Yeah, that X-Pass thing. For every one person who dies, one password will be revealed. Is that true, though? Sigma, why don't you try dying once? You've done it before. Firmly refrain. <laughs> what about you, Diana? Hey, uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> She's so offended by the question. <laughs> <laughs> Up. Well, <laughs> so what was Zero called in VLR? Was he Zero Junior or something? He was, yeah. There, there was two Zeros. There was the little rabbit, which was Zero uh -huh. Junior, and then there was Sigma, who was Zero Senior. Right. <laughs> no, I have the foggy. Yeah. But they called themselves Zero. It's definitely not me this time, I'm pretty sure. What, <laughs> what are you There's one more thing for sure. Think about it. Why was Zero's speech to us pre recorded? There's got <laughs> to be a very big reason why things can't be in real time. There are two possibilities. They've already bit the bullet. Or... Zero is among us. Dun dun dun. Will help come? No. <laughs> Do you think someone will come help us? Like who? Maybe the decom experiment staff? Sorry, but that's pretty unlikely. Remember? The staff stationed in DCOM can't communicate with us right now. The simulation is attempting to stay true to an actual Mars mission. It's at least six months between Earth and Mars. In that time period, Earth will have rotated halfway around the Sun. Which means... By the time the spaceship reaches Mars, the Earth is behind it. With the star in the way, we can't send a signal. That's the lead-up. We've been doing experiments for the past five days. Transmissions will re-establish on December 31st at 2330, which leaves us with more than 10 hours. There's no point in hoping for a rescue to come before then. Pretty sure the DCOM staff won't notice any problems until that time. <laughs> you guys are like siblings. <laughs> You're totally in sync. <laughs> <laughs> that same look. The way Sigma talks. This may be somewhat rude of me to say, but the way you talk, Sigma, is um a little unusual. Forgive him. The age of his mind and his body are completely different. Oh, he mentioned that back at Decom. That his consciousness had Come back from the year 2074. <laughs> That's correct. That's why I know. Doesn't exactly sound like Diana believes must him. Must have spent the past five days <laughs> warning all of you. But also, she just said it so matter-of-factly. Like, <laughs> Kane, Fi, and I infiltrated Decom to stop all that from happening. Fi, is this true? Well, would you believe me if I said that it was? That's the mystery. <laughs> then you could have prevented it. We had no idea what events went down inside the decom facility. Nor did we know anything about what's going to happen in this shelter. You're so mad. <laughs> He's an old crotchety man. Leave him alone. <laughs> He's not made of money. <laughs> Five hundred grand. <laughs> <coughs> oh, 
puppy. Puppy. Gab. Why is Gab here? I think he came through the vent. See anything? No. It's too dark. You're up, Fi. You want <laughs> me to go in there? It's clearly impossible. You sure? I won't repeat myself. Um, my boobs are D's. <laughs> it's true. Seems to me they've gotten a full size larger than the last time you told me. It's been 45 years. <laughs> Growing is natural. <laughs> Just sleeping. Um, can I oh this? god, I missed the interaction between these two. Me too. <laughs> Something's written on it. Hello, Carlos here. Team is voting for I love how formal it is. So I know. Team should vote for Q team and Q team for C Hello, Zuko here. <laughs> Q team, got it. I get it. By spreading out the votes, they're suggesting we make it a tie. Looks like Q team agreed. Seems so. I guess Gab passed through Ward C to Ward Q and ended up here. Hmm. It'll work. Now none of the teams will have to die. Hmm. I wonder about that. Oh, now what? Fi's going to be the negative Nancy. <laughs> the deadline to vote is in 3 minutes. Damn. We don't have much time. We need to head over to the voting device. She says as everyone stands there. <laughs> I'm saying it could be a lie. Do you mean that Q team is planning to betray us? No, I doubt it. That's what they intended. They didn't have to send Gap. They'd only have to decide to vote for D team. Then you mean there's a chance that C team will betray us? Maybe they're saying they'll vote for D team, but actually vote for Q team. Why would they do that? But what if Q team's just trying to play the triple cross? <laughs> if you think it's a good idea to spread out the votes, then your choice is easy, right? I'm just saying. It's a possibility. The deadline to vote is in one minute. What should I do? The fact that Gab showed up means that we can assume Q team's voting for C team. So we have no choice but to choose Q-Team. Otherwise... A single vote could cause the death of all of C-Team. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well let's go ahead and keep with my pattern of being the good guy. <laughs> Like this music. Your yeah. Vote has been accepted. There's definitely some good well, music good in this choice. series. Do you mm -hmm. think it'll be okay? So long as Gab's note was I'm pretty truth. sure this track was in BLR All we could too. Do is trust them. I thought it sounded familiar, but I don't know. Yeah, I might be wrong though. Ninety minutes have passed. Your time has ended. This is a great example of a track that really helps set the tone for the scene. Yeah. That, like, that's what the music in the series is so good at. It's really good at setting the tone. Yeah. Especially that one really creepy track that was like, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> dun. Yeah. I love that track. Like, it's so creepy. And it always plays at, like, exactly the right times. Yeah. I think I need to bump up the voice volume a little bit more. Okay. Zero's voice always sounds really quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Zero time dilemma. Zero time dilemma. Zero time Zero you, uh, you having fun there, boy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Time for part two. Meow. Meow. The, 
a dick. Be a dick. Yeah! Yay! <laughs> Why did you vote for C Team? I. I don't know. What? It's because I you hacked know. her brain! <laughs> I have no idea why I voted for C Team. What are you talking about? Sigma, you That's should know. <laughs> Please believe me. Exact same thing happened to you. <laughs> yeah. Quantum probability. <laughs> 90 minutes have passed. Your time has ended. I'm sure this game is going to tap into the many worlds theory. I mean, the whole series like already does. <laughs> yeah. I've always really liked that as a, uh, an, uh, an idea. Yeah. Even though it doesn't really hold a whole lot of sway in the scientific community, it's still, like, a really cool concept. Oh, yeah, definitely. Especially for a game like this. Or a series like yeah. this, where there's, like, so many branching paths and all. Mm -hmm. As all members of a single team will perish as a result of the vote you enter. Ooh. Yeah, the first time I heard about 999, somebody was like... I was asking, like, well, you know, what's, like... Though there's a bunch of endings, like, what's the canon ending? And they're like, well, all of them? Yeah, I'm and... pretty sure that was me. <laughs> yeah. It's like, huh, that's interesting. Yeah. All right, guys, that's going to wrap us up for today's episode because we are out of time. Tune in next time where we continue on Zero Time Dilemma. See ya. Thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure to click that subscribe button to stay current on all things Duplay. If you really like us, why not support us on GameWisp? We've got lots of awesome rewards for our subscribers, including early access to our videos and exclusive content. Thanks. Catch you guys next time.